Good evening, this is Salutations, I am Vader Prime, and welcome. And today we are in Homeworld Remastered, and uh, I'm looking at the Macross Universe mod. I must be that's the Macross Universe mod, they do not do Robotech. Um, so they do things as Robotech Universe, uh, Robotech, forget Robotech. They do things from Macross Plus, Macross Frontier, I believe, and a few other Macross-based things. I most likely have the, what they're doing posted on the screen, as you can see. Uh, I have gone along and done a few, so we're going to have another look at the units, because they have added one or two for each side. Fixed a few things as well. Uh, so let's go along, straight, get straight down into it. Uh, so, now, if I remember correctly, I was being about to be facing off with an entire group of enemies. Resource injection received. So, let's quickly get into it. First off, let's go along and have the brand, look at the brand new fighters that we're looking at. And that are these. Oh, on, ah, damn it. Actually, let's go along and use our fleet here. Acknowledged. Get you all on Weapon attack. Set to full power. And beat the crap out of them. I sort of want to keep the these ones a bit. Well, because then we are looking at one of them. Ready. Let's get them all into go and go. Attack complete. Awaiting further orders. Aggressive attack. And these are the ones I want to have a look at at the moment. The uh, F. No, the VFX4 prototypes, or otherwise known as lightnings, when they get finished. I don't believe they uh, are capable of transforming, but they are great-looking fighters. And as you can see, pretty good at dealing with the enemy. So they're a new addition to the human side, that the factory we're looking at. I absolutely love these. They were in the other video, I believe, so I can't remember if they were in the original. But I just wanted to make this video, just to make it a bit easier for both factions. They've also leveled out the firing range a bit, because before, that ship there, which had just been blown up, oh no, right there, this little baby was in karate origin, could go along and snipe ships off from a very far distance. So, yes, we fixed that, now it's a bit closer. In fact, I don't think it does snipe anymore. They've also done the same for the human side. Where is the I'll just make a new one, it'll be easier. Uh, but yeah, uh, I personally don't think they've gone along and actually uh, upgrade, uh, done the changing, but they do look great. I don't think they've changed the the model, no, I could be mistaken. I believe that's been changed. Uh, there's another ship, the Armour 2. So they haven't, apart from that, they haven't added any extra onto the human side. I think they may have updated the way everything looks, though, because it does look a lot better. Now, that could just be me. Uh, now, where were the other ones? Roger. Ah, here they are. These are the ones that could also snipe off as well. <laughs> and I say they all opened up. Which was, wasn't bad, but like I say, the, the range. I could be here at my own base and snipe off the enemy if I could see them in sight, which wasn't too good. Now, we are going to go along and, like I say, apart from that, the ship is the same. They've obviously changed the little pictures as well. So you've now got the rockets, the guns, all for the mothership. Same for the other items here. A uh, new bit of research prototype in order to get this one. Uh, yeah, the new one. Before the de development of the VF4, Stonewell slash Belcom built the VF4. X4 Trial Production Variable Fighter, Ooh, so it might be able to transform, as a prototype for the Lightning 3, I believe that is. The Valop started in 2005 and eventually, and eventually test flights were concluded in which some VFX4 fights, uh, fighters were flown by Space War 1 veteran. I can't pronounce his name, I do apologise. So yeah, I think they can actually supposed to be able to, uh, to transform, that's not bad. Uh, I hope they add some more human ships, though. Not you know, ones from Mac uh, Macross Plus and Frontier. Uh, so I don't know a lot about them, but I have seen that quite a lot of them look pretty awesome. So Roger. let's go along and get straight into a fight. Like I say, I'm not going to be spending too long. This no, should no be a quick worries. video. After this, we're going to go straight and fighting Attention, to the Zentrati. Because the Zentrati have new ships blocking. as well. Well, they have one. An interesting one. But we're still going to have a look see if there's anything they can do. Uh, fighters are moving there. No, I don't want to... Resource injection can I just received. bloody click on the damn thing so I can get it to go along and do what I want it to do? Copy. Yes, thank you. 
Let's go along because then you've got hyperspace capability. To jump there. Initiating hyperspace jump. The time you get there. Yep, there you go. Let's go with our house sails. They've just got loads of carriers. Oh no, we've got a new ship as well. We're already engaged. Oh, here we go. The homeworld's mothership is now fighting. We're taking the damage. Let's go along and take this baby out. Because we're going to lose this fight after all, and I don't plan on keeping it. This big thing has got to be constant cannon. I'd say we're going to be using that anyway, but I prefer not to go along and lose straight off to a big massive energy. Yep, yeah, so that's now gone. Begin targeting the mothership again. I think they've changed the fighter style as well, it's got what looks like a flat fighter. Still with these cannons. Gorgeous. Got well, near some target, got more ships coming out. Pick it up, do We just lost our arm at the class. As I don't think they changed the models, but they do look a lot better. So I could be mistaken. Oh, at the moment they're just fighting Captain Roy Fugger. They'll be at him for quite a while. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to pause the recording, and we're going to go straight into the Zentrati. That way it'll be a bit easier. So, back in a mo. Greetings and welcome back. And now, here we are, the Zentrati. Now, there's only really two ships I really want to show here, or three if you count. Last time I said that this one actually connected. So this bit here, as you can see, oh, we have some enemies coming. Our fighters can deal with them. But we've got this one. Now, this is the front section of this beastie Standing back by. here. They can separate, a bit like an Enterprise, you know, a galaxy separate. I don't know if they can go back together again. I never actually remember seeing that. But, like I say, on this one they're both separated. But the new ship they've actually added is actually here. I know it's not much, but they've actually done it where there's a separate one where it's actually integrated all into one. Supporting friendly units. Yes, our forces are in battle. Now, they haven't really updated any fighters or anything, Under fire. but like I say, they have updated the fire. ships. This one I'm not too sure about if it actually has any good weapons. Bearing to target. Uh, let's actually see what it reads about Under it, fire. because obviously it's its own ship. Oh, in fact, oh no, it can actually construct things. So yes, this ship can actually make its own. So this is basically its own command Assembly ship. Underway. It can obviously construct loads of its... Attack fighters. Order. Well, this is actually, according from the description, I think it said, let's... Oh, ooh, that one can also construct things as well. Enemy destroyed. Need so yeah, so the back, end is, the back end is basically the construction set parts. Not bad. Now, where was the... There it is. So let's just have a quick read of the description. I can find the which one. There it is. The female Zentrati Command, I cannot pronounce its name, was utilised was utilised a quads the th I can't pronounce that name either in an alternate fleet colours as her own command ship so in other words a female uh, Zentrati commander as it says there commanded this one which is all together and it's basically her command ship which is neat Ooh, up its nose I said don't know how much it has on weapons Ready. but we're going to find out because we are going to go along into a little fight Order over there. I'm going to take these and the remains of my fighters. Subsystem built and ready for operation. That's good. Construction underway. Construction underway. Because we don't really need you. I just want to make sure to see if this thing can actually fight. I'm not too sure Confirm. if it can. Let's see what it's got. So say it has Copy. weapons. Again, what did them say? Yeah, so Roger. definitely just have some weapons. Acknowledged. So these are fighters. Not much has changed for Roger. them. All still the same. Beautiful little things. Little beauties. Standing by. 
Oh, you all them. Lovely little beautiful things. And obviously our three big beautiful ships. Which we are going to bring get them to jump here. Initiating hyperspace jump. Exit coordinates. Ooh, not confirmed. very much in that way. So let's get into our little Reporting. command ship. Do they have weapons? We're gonna find out. First we're gonna get all our fighters and have them act as a distraction. Copy. So go pester them. Engage. Lock all weapons on target. And you three. Reporting. We're going to be from here. Are going to hit and straight attack the SDF one. So I will switch to aggression. All right, hang in there. Show no mercy. Oh, that one's already fired its missiles. And they've already keep going. I got one. Oh, someone's got a beam. So maybe they haven't fixed some of it. I could be mistaken. Maybe we should actually jump a bit closer. Under attack. What's the call? Hyperspace coordinates locked in. Exiting hyperspace. Pursuing target. Standing by. No. Moving to death. Need to attack. Them. Moving while engaging. We're under fire. Lock all Ooh, weapons. We're taking off for that. Do you have Ready. guns? Will you open fire? I don't think it does. Oh god, there goes the SDF-3 at 1. Got a situation here. There goes you. I think it might be both now. Yeah, so it's laying waste. All personnel, code red. Moving I don't think this has got any weapons, because it's not shooting anything. We're going down, we're going... When you take that? We'll find out if it's... Oh, you know, it's definitely going down now. It is fine with something. Just can't see it. Let me get an old flat What can you see? No, actually, I don't think it is. I don't think... Ooh, there goes the SDF-1. So, yep, yeah, these are just ships I wanted to, to give it a quick show. Okay, so it's an island kind of Under fire, like Yeah, I don't think this one has any weapons, so it could maybe not get finished. But yep, yeah, this is the one, this is what it looks like all together. Actually, I just wanted to, to make a quick video to co combine the two a bit. A bit of new releases to like, so you can confirm that this is a Macross, so there won't be any Robotech in. I hope this has actually helped a bit. Uh, like I say, it's just a quick, neat little video. So, uh, I think we're going to go along and bog ourselves out of here. Ooh. So, until next time, thanks for watching, and, and see you later. Hyperspace jump. Bye. Exit coordinates confirmed.